Good morning, Pigaholic friends. Um, it's late morning here on November 25th, 2023. Um, this last night here, or early morning, we had our first frost of the year. We got down to 31 degrees, and it's going to get a little bit colder the next two nights, according to forecast. But we had some cooler weather already. You can see the leaves are turning yellow. Um, some trees um, go dormant earlier. I believe that those are usually more cold hardy. They get more prepared for the cold weather by going dormant sooner. And, um, you know, most of the trees still have leaves on them and it'll take probably a month before they all drop off. Something like that anyway. Let's see, just going down the row here. This one row here, for some reason, uh, about seven trees here um, are generally weaker trees. Um, here's a tree that's dropped more of its leaves. I've seen a few that have gone dormant completely. You know, we've got some large trees. I kind of lose sight of the fact that the trees have grown so big because I see them every day, but um, they've certainly gotten larger. Here, I, I don't memorize most of the trees, but this was, um, I know this one here is in Kanto because it broke and half of it died. So I only have half on one side of that tree, still a large tree. Here's another tree where it's dro it dropped most of the leaves. And again, I believe that those are usually more cold hardy varieties. I don't know what variety that is right there. I don't have my map with me. Some trees I have memorized, but not most of them. Um, just looking. The leaves come off easy there, but it'll take a while before they lose all the leaves. Um, we'll have our annual fig cutting cell again. Um, I'm planning on doing it a little bit later this year just to because of some travel plans and some other things I need to take care of. And um, you know, maybe the end of January is when we'll have our fig cutting cell. So anyway, a cool day. We have wind from the north coming and again a couple more cold nights. This tree leaves instead of turning yellow they look like they turn brown more. Um, but this was our first morning with frost, um, November 25th. Um, some years we've had earlier frost. I think um, my earliest frost was like November 8th. Um, but this is more typical, so nothing unusual. Back in the distance, there's a tree that has lost almost all of its leaves. Anyway, again, thanks for watching. Hope everyone is staying warm. Take care.